G'day everybody and welcome to another YouTube video. Today we're going to be having a look at the new Transformers Mighty Mugs, the Generation 1 line. Um, so starting off here you can see we have Bumblebee. Uh, as you can see here he also comes, doesn't come with a blaster but you can see that I've sort of put one together for him uh, based on his Generation 1 model. So I'll give you a bit of a spin around. He's um, compared in size, he's shorter, about the same size as Yoda or short round. And I'll give him a bit of a spin around as we all know. He was the VW in the Generation 1 series. So there's the back of him. Coming back to the front, so the big Autobot symbol on the front of the shirt there. Moving on now to the leader of the Autobots, Optimus. I think he'll be very popular, especially with the new movie coming out later this year. Uh, you can see he comes with his big blaster gun. And I'll spin him around for you. So there's the tyres around. There's the exhaust pipes on his arm. Really impressed with Optimus. I think he'll uh, be very popular, even just on his own. Then moving into the Decepticons, we have Soundwave. Um, Soundwave is the probably the most loyal of the Transformers for those Transform, you know, not Transformer fans out there. So that's why I'd say he was probably made in this line along with Megatron. Comes with his Sonic Blaster. Um, for those who can remember or don't know, Soundwave uh, used to transform into like a stereo and then he'd open up and eject cassettes which would then transform into different Decepticons as well. And then finally we have the leader of the Decepticons, Megatron. And this is the G1 Megatron which was saw him transform into a handgun. And as you can see there, comes with his sight which turns into his sort of blaster cannon on his arm there so a little bit different to the other transformers in the sense he doesn't hold the gun there's actually a hold that allows you to put the blaster cannon and attach it onto his arm but uh, again the, the detail in him is uh, quite superb and again I think he'll be a, another popular seller even if you just buy him and Optimus so one more look at them all Coming out in the second wave is Starscream and Grimlock, along with uh, the re-release of Optimus and Bumblebee. I think Starscream will be a, a real winner, and Grimlock, one of the Autobots who transforms into the T-Rex. So he'll be uh, interesting to see what he looks like when he comes out. Adding to this video, we're also going to have a quick look at Storm Shadow and Snake Eyes from the G.I. Joe range. Uh, again, I think these will be two popular characters from that wave. There's also the Cobra Commander and um, the G.I. Joe uh, head character known as Duke. And you can see him on the back with Duke and Cobra Commander there. Uh, these two are really uh, quite interesting to, to put together, being both uh, sort of ninjas, I suppose you could say. They look quite imposing with their swords. Um, this guy here, Storm Shadow, looks really cool, just all in white. Um, really does make him stand out quite a lot when you put him alongside the other mugs. So you can see the detail there into his costume. And then just his eyes shooting through the mask, those menacing eyes, with his blade. And then we have Snake Eyes. Um, comes with an Uzi, as well as his blade. Also has a intricate design. Hopefully the camera can pick that up for you on his costume you can see that he's got like a, a shoulder belt that can uh, carry some grenades as well uh, just painted on so spinning him around has a blade painted on the side of his leg there a pouch on the back and then his menacing eyes or mask that he wears so I hope you've enjoyed that video. Um, keep uh, subscribing, keep reviewing, because hopefully within the next week or week and a half, I'll have my Superman custom as well as a, a Batman custom arriving that I'll be able to review and hopefully uh, show you all. So thanks for watching. Cheers.